New at five, surprise medical bills. You hate them, right? Congress finally took action to help protect people, but there is one big exception they left out, the ground ambulance. They can be lifesavers, but as 12 on your side's Marilyn Moritz reports, they can also cost unsuspecting patients hundreds and even thousands of dollars. When Donna Rosado had a high fever and cough last year, she went to her ER, where they rushed her to a bigger hospital by ambulance. I went to the emergency room where I suddenly became unable to breathe. I was put on a ventilator for 10 days, and I spent a few weeks in an ICU where I slowly recovered from the flu and pneumonia. Rosado, a writer for Consumer Reports, finally returned home to a pile of medical bills. The biggest one was for the ambulance ride, which was not covered by her insurance. Studies show more than three out of four ground ambulance rides can result in an out-of-network bill. And they are not part of the brand new federal No Surprises Act. It's aimed at eliminating surprise medical bills from out-of-network providers, often in emergencies. If we're protecting patients from surprise bills once they get to the emergency room, why not protect them from the surprise bill on the way to the emergency room? Ambulance providers and insurers often disagree on what is a fair rate. Ambulance companies say their services are costly and insurance reimbursements are too low for them to be in network, leaving patients footing the bill. Texas has a law that curbs surprise medical bills, but it left out ground ambulances. Right now, the legislature is considering a bill that addresses that loophole. Meantime, if you receive a surprise ambulance bill, ask your insurer to review the claim. If it's still not covered, ask the ambulance company if they can lower it or offer a payment plan. Talking to my insurer did the trick for me. A few weeks after I contacted my insurer and asked them to review the bill again, I got a notice that they paid the ambulance provider an additional $1,500, covering all but $283 of the original $3,000 bill. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News.